10, we're hearing from a BART passenger who says she was attacked and nearly raped while riding a train in the middle of the day. She says this happened on the Richmond Millbrae line yesterday morning. KTVU's Alyssa Harrington live tonight at the El Sereno Del Norte station. Alyssa, you spoke with the victim. How is she doing tonight? Well, she's very shaken up. She said she spent several hours at the hospital getting treated for her injuries. She said that she was punched in the face during this attack and wants to know what Bart will do to keep other passengers safe. It's so painful. The victim of a terrifying attack on Bart gets a hug from her mom after an emotional and traumatizing experience. The woman, who did not want to be identified for her safety, said she got on BART at Richmond Station Wednesday morning to go to her job in San Francisco, something she does almost every day. It was 11.30 a.m., and the train car she entered was empty. And about a minute in to sitting um, down, I felt somebody behind me. Um, I was in a solo seat, and they were able to go fully go behind me and grab my neck. At first, the woman thought someone was trying to rob her. Then she felt a hand down her shirt. That's when I realized, oh, he doesn't want my phone. He wants my body. He started putting his hands down my shirt and I started fighting with everything I had. The woman started screaming and swinging her arms. She said her attacker punched her in the face. He put his hand over her mouth and she bit his finger until it bled. I realized this is about survival at this moment and honestly he I, he'd have to kill me if he was gonna rape me so that's all I could think about was you know if my family finds me dead at least I tried and they don't know, know that I, I tried my hardest the attacker finally released the woman as they approached the El Cerrito del Norte station she took these pictures and called police I was banging on the windows while we were pulling into the station and then everybody was was seeing what was happening so people started pointing. Very disturbing, very unfortunate fortunate situation. BART Police Chief Ed Alvarez said they pulled video from the train and used pictures taken by the victim to identify the suspect. They tracked him down in Richmond. Officers arrested 21-year-old Ludwin Mazan of San Francisco. Alvarez said passengers should feel safe riding BART. Yeah, people should feel safe. Uh, we have a lot of things in place uh, to make sure that people are safe. We have cameras on our train cars. We have cameras on our platforms. We have train operators that are in the cab that can be e easily access ac accessed. Uh, we have a BART Watch app that allows individuals to report real-time information to our dispatchers. The victim of this attack was critical of police response. She wants more officers patrolling cars and stations and said she has no plans to ride BART again. I didn't think at 11.30 in the morning on my way to work I was going to have to fight for my life on, on a public transportation that I think is supposed to be safe.